it. But thank you. How did you notice me right here? Cause I know I just, I don't. We passed, and I just know what you look like. I must look the same online as I do in person. Yeah. Cause everybody see me out, they be like, "Hey, Marquise," and I'm like, "Do I look the same?" My name is Marquise Rivers, and I'm also known as the DL Detective. I've been shot left for dead people have shot at my mother's home they robbed me or they stole my car and set it on fire they've done everything to try to break me shot robbed attacked <laughs> all that kind of stuff i don't give a fuck about what people think about me i do what i want to do i do what i want to do i mean did you honestly think i wasn't gonna show nobody a lot of women have no idea about the gay lifestyle they have gay friends, they have gay siblings, they have gay family members, you know, but they don't know deep into the gay community. So a lot of women are in relationships with men, married to men, have children with men who they actively are sleeping with or have slept with that are in relationships with men. And they would never know if no one said anything because there's several other gay men out here who won't do what I do, who are not going to tell people Hey, I'm sleeping with your boyfriend. Or hey, I'm sleeping with your husband. So I met bruh. He seen the post on my page and shit. I met him. See, goddamn. Um, motherfucker out there chasing me and shit. I'm scared for my motherfucking life. You know what I'm saying? Nigga know where I live, everything like. Y'all women don't understand the shit that I have to go through. Like. To help y'all know these niggas be on the down. Like, you get what I'm saying? Y'all don't know. All them haters who say whatever the fuck they want to say about me, they can say what the fuck they want to say about me. Because the DL detective, I'm going to get them. I'm going to get every last one of y'all motherfucking niggas. And I'm going to put my motherfucking life at risk for it. Because they didn't even try, almost try to kill me. But I got that ass though on here. Camera, my nigga. I got that nigga. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But you with all these thug ass niggas think you a little rapper, my nigga. But I got you though, nigga. Women is what I do this for, because they were my safe havens growing up. Women have always been my friends. Women have always came to my aid. Growing up, boys didn't want to hang out with me. I was too feminine. I wasn't picked to play on the basketball team. I couldn't play football with them. They didn't want to go outside and play. So when I was sitting alone at the lunch table, it was girls, come over here, Marquise. Come over, forget them. Well, if I get into a physical altercation, girls got my back. So I'm who I am today because of women. The most that I get mostly is, is three things. I'm gonna kill you, I'm gonna kill myself, or how much money do you want to stop doing what you're doing? December 28th, 2016, uh, Download Man um, was trying to get evidence from me to so that I wouldn't be able to publicly expose him for being homosexual, and he shot me and left me for dead. And hey everybody, I know this has been a long anticipated waiting video, but I just wanted to kinda let the record straight. Um, no, everything was not a hoax. I mean, I know there's a lot of different stories. I'll just let the record straight. Um, I know everybody's been anticipating hearing what I have to say. I am fine and well. Yes, I was uh, shot by a download man. I was on life support for five days. I had to learn how to walk again. If they didn't care about what people thought about them, they would be openly gay. Their reputation is their lives. So when you damage their reputation in a way that they don't want to be damaged, their lives are gone. So they'll try to take yours because now they can't go back to the hood where they are or they can't go back to their jobs or they can't be around their family or their, or their mother of their child might let them around their children anymore. So, or, or they might just be afraid to be seen in the general public as a homosexual man. So because you've taken their life from them, they will take your life from you. Because I could tell you I'm sleeping with a man or you could think it, but no one's going to bring you the proof like Marquise. I'm going to bring you the proof. I'm going to bring you the video, the audio recordings, the, the pictures, the, the, any type of a scandal that he's doing with another man. I'm going to be the one. If you want to know if your man is on the down low, you call Marquise Rivers. And I'm going to find out. I'm going to find out, and I'm going to notify you. And, and I'm going to let everybody know. I'm going to let the entire world know. I'm not, to, I'm not to play with when it comes to that. I don't work alone. I have decoys. I have, I have to pay people for information. I have uh, gay men that work for me, transgender m women who are n men who are now women that work for me, um, that help me and aid me in what I do. 
and basically I, I go out I get I have hidden audio recording stuff that I have that I can record them admitting to what we have done or what they will do whether they want to be paid to have sex whether they're soliciting themselves for sex um, sometimes I invite them over to my personal home or to hotel rooms. I have sex with them. I record it and I post it for the entire world to see. You either come out or I'm going to bring you out. It's either one. Every woman who I notify, I'm saving a life. Every single one. Because that man could give her anything sexually, you know. So when you playing Russian roulette with other people's lives, I'm going to have a say-so in it when it relates to women. This is my girlfriend. It's the only girlfriend I got. And this is my mama. And as you see, my mama has leukemia, um, uh, cancer. And a lot of my, I mean, that's really why I go so hard, really, even with my money. I mean, I, I got to take care of my mama, too. I mean, I can't be a son if I don't take care of my girlfriend. This is the only girlfriend I got, because <laughs> I surely ain't going to have no other one. For a long time, I was really nervous, and I and I tried to talk my kids out of doing this because it does worry me. He died on the table for 15 to 20 minutes, um, but God brought him back. So I have, I have a reason to believe in him even more now because I feel like if it wasn't for God that brought him back to me, that, you know, if it wasn't, this wasn't his calling, then God would have took him away. All I do is ask to be careful. You know, and and tell them they're going to jail, and you're gonna be in court they, crying if yeah, they kill me. They, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna support him. I'm That's gonna right. support him. I'm gonna so if you kill him. me, my mama gonna be in there crying on the stand. <laughs> so don't think you get away. You done took her son from her. You going to jail? Yeah, they're going to jail. They're going to jail. They're going to jail. They're going to jail. Prison. Yeah, prison. They're gonna have to. Absolutely, because I don't have nobody else but you. All I have is you. Okay. Yeah, they're going, I have, I mean, <laughs> they going to jail. They going to jail. No. Doesn't do this, but. And then when they go to jail, they're gonna be with men anyway, so they might as well just I let it go. Exactly. Cause exactly. ain't no women in an all man prison. Absolutely not. So they might as well just let it go. Absolutely. Yeah, cause if they go to prison, they're gonna be they're gonna be forced into it. Absolutely. Yeah, they're well, gonna you know be gay what? one way or another. You know they were gay before they got with him. You can never take a straight man's virginity. Never. It will never happen. No straight man will sleep with a man. Absolutely not. So if I, I have care. sex with a man, I, he, I took his virginity. He been gay. He been gay he all been his gay. life. Just, I just took his virginity. Absolutely. He ain't, you can't turn out a straight man. A straight man never going to give you the opportunity. That's absolutely. why they're straight. You absolutely. was just gay and I just was the first man you ever been with. If you just come out and live your life open and you have receipts to prove it, where you been? You, if Lil Johnny said, Eddie Long, you know you was at my house when I was 12 years old this time. No, I wasn't because I was at, I was at Costa Rica at this time. See, here my flight, you know, itinerary. Or, you know, or, or Lil Greg say, I, Eddie Long, you know we was at the bathroom in Walmart that day. No, I wasn't because I was at a church's convention of that day. But if, but if somebody say you having sex and you have nowhere to prove, you tell you got this camera in front of me. So I can't say we done nothing because you got that camera right there. So you can say, oh, no, we didn't.